channel i hope you're all well it's been a little while i can't lie i say that it's been two weeks it's not that long but i mentioned before i don't just want to film for the sake of filming today i have for you a haul but kind of a different type of haul my friend amelia actually beat me to it with this video and i had to miss her and i was like please don't think i've copied you because i haven't i was just waiting for the stuff to arrive and it was taking forever basically but today i have for you kind of like a depop vintage haul if you don't know what depop and vintage are apps so people can sell their clothes and earn money and obviously you can buy them normally for cheaper than what they're worth it's also really good for like small independent brands because they can obviously make their stuff to order and i love to support an independent brand so without further ado let's get started so the first thing i picked up was from depop and it is this really cute jumpsuit basically it's this kind of pastel baby blue jumpsuit with like white legs i, I paid maybe like 12 pound with delivery which is really affordable when i got it it was literally perfect condition there were no marks whatsoever i mean it's kind of fraying and ripping a little bit there but it's nothing major and that can easily be sewn up so the thing with buying obviously from vintage and depop is normally they don't accept returns because it's just like a normal person selling their clothes so there's two things that i bought that don't fit me so now i'm gonna have to kind of resell or but the first one of those two things is this really cute ribbed plunge unitard now i'm not gonna lie i got this as an in an eight which would be my normal size for this and it literally doesn't go over my thighs but it is from pretty little thing and i know pretty little thing comes up quite small but i literally paid five pound for this and it's brand new with tags and online i did have a look it's like 11 pound although i did have to pay postage that's the thing with all of this stuff i have to pay postage for most of the stuff anyway yeah i do actually really love this unitard it just doesn't fit like literally it doesn't fit i couldn't even squeeze into it if i wanted to squeeze into it let me tell you now you can hang literally your way through life on depop and vintage because at the end of the day whoever's selling it is just trying to make a little bit of money like normally when i go to buy something i'll either ask if they do free delivery or if they'll lower the price and most of the time to be fair they say yeah anyway i picked up this o poly top which also does not fit however i have managed to resell it so buzz in but again it's literally perfect condition it's so cute it just doesn't it doesn't fit you can kind of see on the inside there where it's been like tried on like just where it's rubbed off a little bit and it didn't have tags when i got it but they stated it was brand new and to be fair looking at it there are no marks on it i know i put it is quite like tricky with sizing like some things come up really stretchy some things don't and this just wasn't really stretchy like i thought it would be the next thing i picked up i literally had a mare with so i ordered it it got sent they provided the tracking for it i checked the tracking a few days later and it said it had been delivered so i went outside had a little look and it literally just wasn't anywhere the neighbors wasn't in the garden wasn't in the house wasn't behind the car literally wasn't anywhere so i messaged the people and was like it's saying it's been delivered but obviously it hasn't i'm not gonna lie the seller was just a bit rubbish they were like well it's not our problem blah blah and i was like well I know it's not your problem, but it is kind of your problem at the same time. It turns out it got delivered to the wrong address, but it is really cute, just kind of um, white North Face um, fleece. Outside is literally perfect condition and it is so cute and I love that it's got pockets. They do describe it as like, not vintage, but like it has been worn, so it's not got like, it's not perfect. But they're meant to state like what is wrong with it. And there was nothing stated with it, which is why I bought it, because I didn't want to spend money on something that wasn't the best condition. However, somewhere there is like little marks on, a, on the inside. Oh, here. And I know it's on the inside, but like, can you see that? I don't want marks on it. So I'm hoping if I put a bit of vanish or something, it comes out. Oh, look, another one here. But it fits literally so nicely. I just thought that English summer is so unpredictable. So I could just have this like in the evening to throw on, like if it's a nice day, throw on in the evening and I won't get cold. So the next top I got, I technically bought from Instagram, but she is a Depop brand. I just follow her on Instagram and she said she could do it slightly cheaper if I bought it from Instagram. So that is what I did. It is this really cute, um, kind of like halter neck. Let me just take a minute to look at the pattern, first of all. It is completely handmade. And it's from a brand called Wavy Baby. I've actually mentioned Wavy Baby in a vlog, maybe back in like April, because I actually won something from their giveaway. And I'm literally obsessed with that top. And I wanted one of these tops from her for ages. 
I was just kind of waiting for like the right fabric to come in and then she had loads all at one go and I was like I can't choose so she chose this one for me it fits like a dream and let me just tell you how much it was I paid £12.30 including delivery she made it the next day and posted it the same day first class for £12.30 like what a babe it was just so affordable right let's ignore this horrible setup because it is now the next day but i realized i forgot to show you one of the things i got so hold your horses i picked up a pair of shoes and i've been wanting shoes like this literally for the longest time but on depop they're all like 35 pound minimum and i don't have 35 pound for a pair of shoes like these so when i found these ones on depop i was like short on vintage sorry I was like, surely there's something wrong because I paid £14 including delivery. Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, these. So they are kind of thigh high boots. They go just over the knee. They are like a leathery material. They have the most gorgeous style. Like look how chunky that is. That's going to give me some height because I'm only small. So that's going to make me tall. And the best thing about it is they are literally brand new. I'm shook. My favourite piece. Definitely my favourite piece. Anyway, back to the actual video now. Bye. Oh, I forgot I picked this up. So the next thing I picked up is a kind of like a faux leather black coated kind of material. It's just this little skirt here. I had one of these from Misguided sitting in my wardrobe. And I tried it on the other day when I was torn out. And it literally just did not go past my legs. And to be fair, I did buy it like a year and a half ago. So I thought I would treat myself to new one i say treat myself it was literally a fiver exactly the same just from the plt it didn't have tags but she did say it was brand new and looking at it it looks literally perfect condition which is what we love before i show you the next item if you can see like dirt on it that is because there is dirt on it i wore these out on the weekend and just haven't washed them yet i picked up again they're kind of black coated faux leather material these just skinny trousers they were new out tags and i think i paid like eight pounds they literally fit unreal like quality is unreal they're super stretchy like if you feel bloated it doesn't matter because it just stretches around your body i'll get so much wear out of these okay so this is the last item before i show you i kind of got mugged off a bit with it kind of so it's a zara skirt and everyone on Depop was selling it for like £25. I thought it was really good because it's a really nice skirt. Anyway, I went on to the Zara website to see how much it was actually worth. And it's in the final sale for £6. Yes, it was sold out, so I wouldn't have been able to buy it from Zara. But the final sale for it was £6. I paid 20 which I mean, it's a beautiful skirt. You'll see it in a minute. So I'm not mad, but I could have got it even cheaper if I just saw it on Zara. Let me show you it. Do you know why I'm calling it a skirt? Because it's a score. It's just this kind of... Cool. It's got pockets at the back. It's kind of like um, a creamy colour. It's got a cute little like tie here, but it doesn't actually do it. And then a zip on the side to get in. And to be fair, it was free delivery because I got the delivery taken off and I got it down, which is good. It was sent the next day, first class. So I then got it the next day again. But yeah, it's literally just a beautiful skirt. It's kind of like linen material, which we love. Anyway, that is the end of kind of my Depot Vintage haul you know what i'm not gonna lie i do actually buy quite a lot of deep and vintage i just think save the planet that is the end as i said i hope you enjoyed and i apologize kind of missing two weeks hopefully i will be back on track i've literally just been so busy as i said um i didn't want to film for the sake of it but thank you for watching please make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video